Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to give you a drone tour of the construction of the Portmore Resilience Park. Now this is a massive undertaking, massive development that's being done by the UDC, Urban Development Corporation. They are going to develop this massive piece of land, 26 acres, into a park. This land is located in the heart of Portmore. Across the road is the Portmore Mall, one of the busiest malls in Jamaica. This road you're looking at takes you, is one of the main roadways into Portmore because when you come off the highway, Highway 2000 or the Portmore Expressway, it's a roundabout around the park, so you have to pass the park. If you're driving out of Portmore back onto the highway, you have to pass the park. So this is prime real estate. Prime real estate. So you really have to commend the UDC or the government for building a park here because they could have put up a number of other structures and the government is spending 4.4 billion dollars billion to build this park as you can see work has started construction is on the way and we're giving you an update so we're going to go through an article that gives more information on what's happening here more information on the park The Urban Development Corporation, under its Urban Spaces program, endeavors to build a park in every parish in Jamaica. Urban Spaces supports the government of Jamaica's thrust towards increasing green spaces across the country towards the holistic wellness of its citizens. With the recent successful completion of Harmony Beach Park in Montego Bay, a 26-acre lot located within Portmore St. Catherine has presented itself as a suitable location for the immediate continuation of urban spaces. The identified property, Lot 26 Portmore Town Centre, is owned by the UDC and is earmarked for development as a community green space and park to accommodate recreational and, so and sporting activities. Given the high population density, air quality, and high temperatures that exist in the Portmore community, which are exacerbated by the climate change phenomenon, a green relief space would seek to alleviate some of the effects of these conditions. In 2015, the German city of Hagen signed a memorandum of understanding with the Portmore Municipal Council to fund the development of a climate change park within Portmore, which would include the planting of several trees a running walking trail, a pond, monuments, wind turbines, an observation tower, areas for small indigenous animals, a public awareness component and other elements. Further to this, initial negotiations were made with the UDC and preliminary site work was later to be carried out by the PMC towards the creation of a climate change park. Concurrent with these happenings was an expression of interest from the Ministry of Transport and Mining in using part of Lot 26 as a location for developing a transportation hub. Alright guys, so that's the end of the article. So basically that's what they plan to do with this area. I will keep you guys updated as the work continues all right guys thanks for taking the tour remember to like share and subscribe have a good day